Welcome to Cash Your Travel. Today we are going to see about Langkawi, Malaysia. Langkawi, officially known as Langkawi, the jewel of Kedap, Malay. Langkawi Permata Kedap is a district and an archipelago of 99 islands, plus 5 small islands visible only at low tide, in the Malacca Strait some 30 kilometers off the mainland coast of northwestern Malaysia. The islands are a part of the state of Kedap which is adjacent to the Thai border. On the 15th of July 2008, Sultan Abdul Halim of Kedah consented to the change of name to Langkawi Permata Kedah in conjunction with his Golden Jubilee celebration. By far the largest of the islands is the eponymous Langkawi Island, Pulau Langkawi, with a population of some 64,792, the only other inhabited island being nearby Tuba Island. Langkawi is also an administrative district, with the town of Kuar as its largest town. Pente Senan is the most popular beach and tourist area in Langkawi, with tens of thousands of visitors each year. Etymology. The name Langkawi is thought to have existed by the early 15th century, although in the 16th century the island of Langkawi was also marked on maps variously as Langa, Lanka, Langchura and Langapura. There are many suggestions for the origin of the name of Langkawi. According to one interpretation, Langkawi means island of the reddish-brown eagle, a Brahmini kite in colloquial Malay point the Malay word for eagle is Helang, shortened to Lang, and Koi is a red stone used as a chalk to mark goods. This interpretation was used to create the landmark sculpture of an eagle as the symbol of Langkawi at Dataran Helang. Eagle Square, in Kuar. Some believe that Langkawi is the same as, or related to, the Lanka or Langkapuri mentioned in Indian sources. This ancient name Lanka, or Langkapura and Langkapuri, is found in Indian literature from an early period, named in Ramayana as the city of the King Ravana, although the identification of the original Lanka is not certain. Puri or Puram in Sanskrit means a town or city. The name Langkawi is also thought to be related to Langkasuka, an old kingdom believed to have links with Kedah. Some also thought that Langkawi means many beautiful islands, Lanka being a Sanskrit word meaning beautiful, while we means many. In 2008, the then Sultan of Kedah, Abdul Halim Muadzam Shah, conferred the title of Langkawi Permata Kedah, meaning Langkawi. The jewel of Kedah upon the island as part of his golden jubilee is an affirmation of Kedah's ownership over the island. History. Langkawi had long been at the periphery of, but closely associated with, the domain of the Kedah Sultanate. Legend tells of a great snake Alabeza, the custodian of the Langkawi Islands, to which a new king of Kedah must sacrifice a virgin daughter whenever he first ascended the throne or when a war was declared with another state. The island of Langkawi was recorded in history by various travelers to the region. It was called in the 14th century by the Yuan dynasty traveler Wan Dalen, and when the Ming dynasty admiral Zheng he visited the region, the island was marked as in his map. In the 15th century, it was known to the Assanese as Pilor Ladder Pepper Island as they came over to plant pepper. In 1691, the French general Augustin de Bole recorded going to the island of Langkahu Langkawi to buy pepper, and de Bole was required to obtain a license from Kedas heir apparent then in Perlis before the Penghila or chief of Langkawi would sell pepper to him. Langkawi was historically home to seafarers, such as the Orang Lord or Sea People originally from the southern part of the Malay Peninsula as well as pirates and fishermen. It had been thought to be cursed for a couple of centuries, according to local legend. In the late 18th century, a woman named Majuri was wrongfully accused of adultery and put to death, and she placed a curse on the island that would last for seven generations. Not long after Majuri's death, in 1821, the Siamese army invaded Kedah and attacked Langkawi. In the first attack, 
the locals decided to burn down the granary at Padang Matsirat to starve and drive out the Siamese army. The Siamese nevertheless finally captured the island in May 1822, killed its leaders, and many of the islanders were taken as slaves, while others were forced to flee. Before the Siamese invasion, there was an estimated island population of 3 to 5,000, and only a small proportion was left after the invasion. The island was recaptured from Siamese rule in a campaign against the Siamese in 1837. In 1840-1841, the Sultan of Kedah, who went into exile after the Siamese attacks, was allowed to return by the Siamese, and the population of Langkawi Islands recovered afterwards mainly due to settlement of immigrants from Sumatra. However, the Orang Lord who fled after the Siamese attacks did not return. In 1909. The islands came under British rule under the Anglo-Siamese Treaty of 1909. The middle of the channel between Teruteo National Park and Langkawi would become the Siamese border, and Teruteo would be part of Siam, while all the Langkawi Islands to the south would come under British rule. During the World War II, Siam took control briefly as British Malaya fell to the Japanese, Langkawi had been a haven for pirates which affected the northern part of the Strait of Malacca. In a series of operations, between December 1945 and March 1946, the British cleared the pirates' land base in Langkawi into Ruteo. The British continued to rule until Malaya gained its independence in 1957. Langkawi remained as a quiet backwater until 1986, when the then Prime Minister Mahathi Mohamad decided to transform it into a major tourist resort, helping to plan many of the island's buildings himself. The curse placed by Majuri for seven generations was said to have lifted as the seventh generation descendant of Majuri who now lives in Fukuoka province was born. Point the island rapidly grew as a tourist destination, and by 2012, it had received over 3 million tourists a year. Geography map of Langkawi. Langkawi, a cluster of 99 islands separated from mainland Malaysia by the Strait of Malacca, is a district of the state of Kedah in northern Malaysia and lies approximately 51 km west of Kedah. The total land mass of the islands is 47,848 hectares. The main island spans about 25 km from north to south and slightly more for east and west. The coastal areas consist of flat, alluvial plains punctuated with limestone ridges. Two-thirds of the island is dominated by forest-covered mountains, hills and natural vegetation. The island's oldest geological formation, the Machin Shang Formation, was the first part of Southeast Asia to rise from the seabed in the Cambrian more than half a billion years ago. The oldest part of the formation is observable at Telakdata to the northwest of the island, where the exposed outcrop consists of mainly sandstone, quartzite, in the upper parts and shale and mudstone in the lower parts of the sequence. In fact, the best exposure of the Cambrian rocks, 541 to 485 ma, in Malaysia is the Machinchang Formation, made up of quartzose clastic rock formations. In Langkawi, the other known correlative, the Jere Formation, crops out near to the west coast of Kedah on the mainland, peninsula. Geologically speaking, all these rocks are located within the western belt of peninsula Malaysia, which is thought to be part of the Shantai terrain. Tourism Islands of Langkawi. On the 1st of June 2007, Langkawi Island was given a World Geopark status by UNESCO. Three of its main conservation areas in Langkawi Geopark are Machin Kang Cambrian Jefferest Park, Kilim Kast Jefferest Park, and Ayang Bunting Marble Jefferest Park, Island of the Pregnant Maiden Lake. These three parks are the most popular tourism area within Langkawi Geopark. In 2014, UNESCO issued a yellow card warning threatening the status of the geopark. Sunset at Langkawi Island. 
the link on UNESCO Global Geopark status was due for renewal in 2015, of which upon thorough inspection by the appointed geopark inspectors, Langkawi was issued the certificate of membership dubbed the Green Card by Asia Pacific Geoparks Network, under the auspices of the Global Geopark Network GGN. Tourists can enter the island via ferry from Kuala Kedah, Kuala Perlis, and Penham, or by domestic flight from Kuala Lumpur International Airport, Kul, via Malaysia Airlines, AirAsia, Malindo Air, or Sabang Sultan Abdullah's Shah Airport, SZB, via Malindo Air and Fireflies providing budget connection to the island. International connection is available from Singapore via Tiger Air and AirAsia, as well as from Guangzhou via AirAsia. Islands and beaches sunset at Senan Beach. There are two main island areas, the southern islands, with a heavier tourist population, and the islands to the northeast which are more secluded with little tourist traffic. Langan Island has a freshwater lake called Pregnant Maiden Lake and has a sandspit beach on its south-facing orientation. Dendang Island next to it forms a bay used by Langkori Sailing Yacht Tour Operators, 34, Senang Beach, a sunny view. Some of the most popular beaches are Pantai Senang, Pantai Tengap, Biror Bay, Pantai Kok, and Datay Bay. Pantai Senang Beach has long stretches of fine white sand. It has a number of restaurants and bars for evening entertainment, several hosting live music, and for watching the sunset. Tone. The beach is lined with tall coconut and cassiarana trees. Pantai Tenga is separated from Senan by a small cape. It also faces the setting sun, and has hotels than bars, making it less busy in the evening. Original research. Biror Bay, fringed by rocky outcrops, is visited by migratory birds. Pantai Kok Quiet Beach has a backdrop of limestone hills. Date Bay has a combination of forests and sea. Its white sandy beach is backed by forest. Citation needed. Langkori Cable Car Cable Car and Sky Bridge The Langkori Sky Bridge above the rainforest canopy. The Langkawi Cable Car takes visitors up to the peak of Gunung Mat Chang, where the Langkawi Sky Bridge is located. The Sky Bridge was closed in 2012 for maintenance and upgrading, but reopened in February 2015. An inclined lift called Sky Glide, that would take visitors from the top station to the Sky Bridge was completed in late 2015. The start of cable car ride is located in the Oriental Village, where there are a number of attractions, including a three-dimensional art museum known as Art in Paradise, the Kilimkas Jafarest Park, the Kilim River. The Kilimkas Jafarest Park consists of three river estuaries that stretch from Kisap Village approximately 10 and km to Tanjungru, and they are all interconnected. They are rich in wildlife with hairy-nosed sea otters, brown-winged kingfishers, monitor lizards, and swimming macaque monkeys being common sights. There is also a bat cave within the Jefferest Park. 37. Limestone, inherently porous, forms caves and there are several in the mangroves. One of Langkawi's natural beauty spots is the Pirate Lagoon just outside the river. Technically this is a collapsed cave, Han, consisting of a cave entrance from the sea emerging into a hidden lagoon with towering, limestone escarpments, and smaller caves, citation needed, Pantai Senan Beach Senan has many water sport activities, activities, with Langkawi surrounded by the sea, there are various water based activities to indulge in, for those that love cruises, there are various cruises that can accommodate for individuals that love the morning sun or individuals that would like to have dinner on a yacht. Snorkeling is also a popular activity, with operators organizing daily tours to the nearby Pear Island, Malay, Pilor Pear. Tourists can also choose to go for island hopping tours with different options slow, traveling and spending time on selective private islands slash beaches, fast, 
sitting on a speedboat for a quick spin around the various islands available in Langkawi. Transportation boarding flight at Langkawi International Airport Anas and Selfie Taxi in Langkawi. The island of Langkawi does not have public transportation, but the people can still use taxis or enter vehicle, car, bicycle, motorbike, scooter, etc. All taxis have a standard fixed price system with the fare from one part of the island to another is always being the same. As an alternative, ride hailing apps, such as Grab, also operate on the island. The island of Langkawi can be reached by sea and air. The Langkawi jetty point connects the island to main destinations like Kuala Perlis, Kuala Kedap, Penang, and Tamalang. There's also ferry service to Saturn Town and to Ko Lip Island in Thailand. 40. From Langkawi, Malaysia, a ferry operates from Langkawi to Ko Lip and back from October until June. The departure slash arrival point in Langkawi is at Kua Jetty, Langkawi and Telaga Harbour, Langkawi. The departure slash arrival point in Ko Lip is at Pate Beach. As there is no pier in Ko Lip, transfers to the beach are done with local long tail boats. The journey takes about 1 hour and 30 minutes. The Langkawi International Airport is one of the seven international airports in Malaysia and connects the island to Kuala Lumpur, Singapore, Penang, and Sabang. The main island is well served by a number of roads. Thank you.